Beautifully played. That could be six. Well struck over Long Island. There she goes. The second big hit of the day. That was beautifully timed, just moving into that half volley. And the crowd love it. And good ball selection then, too, from Greg Matthews. He'd been playing with the pad. Obviously, Ravi Shastri a little bit frustrated with that. He thought he'd pitch one up just a little further. And Matthews, equal to the task, picked it up beautifully and plonked it right over the boundary. That was a good shot. Close, very close. Umpire Ishwood has a good look. Swung, it was a fraction forward. Well worth the shout. Beautiful piece of bowling. See the silly point in the short leg, quite close. Beautifully timed. Beats backward square leg. Full value for that shot. Six runs off the over. Six for 185. Beautifully played. The late cut, we don't see that very often, but that was beautifully timed. And this crowd at the MCG really enjoying this partnership. And that was a beautifully timed shot from Greg Matthews. Just outside off stump, he didn't try to smash the cover off the ball. He protected the stumps first and foremost, and then brought the bat down on top of it. And then on strike. Bit of a belt. A big hit out there. Capital Dev will have to uh, take some notice of this. The fact that uh, Matthews is so strong on the onside when he's hitting, he'd have to play a deep square or more likely a deep mid wicket. Yep. Good placing, and that's his 50. Take the third. That was a very good half century from Greg Matthews. He's played wonderfully well this summer so far. Ravi Shastri replacing Shivyal Yadav. Matthew <laughs> steps back and tries to cut that one. And I tell you what, anyone who thought that the spin had gone out of this wicket, let's have a look at this one. It's probably the most interesting delivery of the day so far. And look how high it bounces. And that puff of dust coming out of that wicket again. And that's certainly going to be the, the danger end down there. Look at it, kick. Kimani did well in the end to get a glove to it. And the hottest part about playing those deliveries is if, if they bounce very high. Well, everything's ready for Matthews again. Down the wicket he comes, hits it in the air, into the gap on the offside. That's a lovely shot by Matthews. Showing a bit of aggression here to the quick bowler. Capital Dev, and uh, what an innings this is turning out to be for Australia. He now moves on to 68. Ravi Shastri to Matthews. Shot and well placed. One of the things Matthews does so well, if he's going to hit, then he places the ball, he's taking it over the top of the infield, and he put that right between two men in the outfield. It's a good shot. It's over Shiva, other Christian's head, miles back. And those tactics are very good. Now the pressure is right back on the spin bowler. Matthews can take his time. Perhaps uh, play a little cut as he did in one of the earlier overs. Magnificent stroke. Cleared the boundary by 10 or 12 metres, a big hit. Now Matthews can go straight down the ground here. There is uh, a mid on three parts of the way to the boundary and a long off. But he can go straight down the ground, anything that's pitched up. Or he can go past square leg if it's full toss. I don't think the captain will be too pleased about that. No, and this well could be uh, runs that put Australia in a position to really go on the attack when they take the ball. This was a bad delivery. Matthews goes to 90. And what an innings. Now probably go for Bay 13 or 15. The straight hits. Well, there's a good shot. He's beautifully played. He's very intelligent cricket. He didn't rush down at that. He knew exactly where he was going to hit it if it happened to be pitched on the offside. And he carved it away over extra cover. Gave the fellow out at long off no chance at all. That's beautiful footwork. Three balls bowled so far in this over. 
plenty of tension for Matthews. That's well bowled. Now one ball to go. This uh, field placing now will be indicative of uh, the way the Indians are thinking. Will they bring in all the men to stop him getting the single? which would bring him within one of his century. Yeah, they're going to concentrate on uh, a tight infield and still keep all those men around the boundary. Right, well, there's a single out on the offside between point and cover. <laughs> a great effort. What a great effort. <laughs> well, he deserved to be happy under very difficult conditions. And Dave Gilbert ran 40 metres then to congratulate his partner. A standing ovation from the members, the outer. And that was quick. The gloves got a top edge and pulled through the vacant slip cord and standing ovation from his captain. What a wonderful Christmas it is for great Greg Matthews and all the Australian public who love a fighter. A tremendous innings, beautifully played, and the crowd love it. Gilbert uh, has been a staunch ally out there for made 41, Gilbert 4. And that is out. Put behind the end of the innings. But Matthews will come down and congratulate Gilbert and thank him. Gilbert will feel disappointed, but he did a terrific job there. And Matthews' first thought was to rush up to his batting partner and say, well done. And so it was. Certainly was a great innings from Greg Matthews. And I think a great moment for Australian cricket. They come up off the mat and fought very hard, the lower order. And a standing ovation for a cricketer who's brought life back into the Australian team, not only with the bat, but also in the field. And Greg Matthews, a tremendous personality, makes his second hundred of the season in Test cricket. Gets a wonderful ovation. He points to all points of the crowd, the out of the members. And a great moment in his life. And I think a great moment for cricket in general. Well played, Greg Matthews. Uh, what a performance that was uh, by Greg Matthews. One of the best I've seen on this ground. And uh, I guess it's one of the best I've seen on any other ground as well. He came in when Australia were 5 for 109, fought his way through. He had two distinct areas to his innings. One he had to battle through in yesterday's conditions, which were far from conducive to good batting. And today he had only Bruce Reed and Dave Gilbert with him. 100 not out. 74 out of the last 84 runs. A terrific performance. And those two partnerships this morning, Matthews and Reed, 21 in 27 minutes. Matthews and Gilbert, 46 in 48 minutes. And don't underwrite in any way the performance of Dave Gilbert. He played with great common sense and uh, a lot of courage out there. Wouldn't give way for a moment. And he saw his New South Wales partner through to 100.